Hello everyone, today we will be learning how to create this beautiful photo frame from resin. So here we have already done our base layer. In the base layer we have mixed 180 ml of resin with 60 ml of hardener which is in the ratio of 3 is to 1. So 180 ml resin with 60 ml of hardener. In the colors we have used pink pearl pigment, blue pearl pigment and white pearl pigment so we have mixed them in three different colors with a little resin with some gold foil bright gold foil so we have with all these colors we have created this base layer and now it's a day two we are placing our vinyl sticker this is a name and date customized with vinyl sticker you can order it from tulsiresin.com the size selected is as the our frame size is 10 inch we have selected the name size as 5 inches with 5 inch width you add up the date in the second line and they will be done accordingly peel off the covering from the sticker and they are easy peel off stickers now we'll be placing the picture this is a laminated pictures we have get it printed from a photo print shop and then we have laminated it for Faviquick, why we are using Faviquick? Because we want to avoid the bubbles. If we stick it from all the corners nicely on the resin frame, it will avoid creating any bubbles with the resin. So that's why we place it nicely and stick it nicely. Then we place these flowers. So I give a pinch of Faviquick to the flowers too, so they does not misplace. And then we have poured the clear resin. Again, we have used 3 to 1 resin, art epoxy resin. We have mixed 90 ml of resin with 30 ml of hardener that makes the 120 ml of resin. The upper layer, when we, pit, when we place any pictures, stickers or any flowers, we do not make that layer too thick. We always try to make it as a coating. So just 1 or 2 mm covering would be fine. Spread it nicely so that it covers all the surface of your frame. And now we'll be placing the insert sheet. Even while we use insert sheet, we do not pour it up to a thick level. Just 1 or 2 mm thickness so that our pictures, our frames or sticker does not float or come on the top. So that's why a 1 or 2 mm coating would be fine. Insert sheet, you have to place them on wet resin and again on top you have to cover them with wet resin so they get inserted completely in resin and become transparent even if we place too much of resin while placing this insert sheet or content they may change their place they get misplaced with lot of resin and their flow that's why I just use a top coat resin or just one or two mm layer to place these stickers After spreading it nicely, pop the bubbles from isopyl alcohol and leave it to dry for the next day. And now our frame is completely ready.